Shuffle play my sicko mode playlist. What's cracking? What's popping? What's good, everybody? My name is Taisa. If you didn't know, now you know. Um, the only way you would know is if you happen to fucking know me. <laughs> but I'm sure none of you do because I'm just trying to have fun and do some shit on my own. And I think putting stuff out on YouTube is something that will allow me to be more comfortable with whatever the fuck I post. Not that I'm like ashamed if anyone that I know sees it. I'm just not really catering to them as like my primary audience, you know? Like I'd rather have people get to know me, plus anyone who feels like they did know me in the past, you don't. <laughs> the reason I say that is because I am a growing person, an ever growing person. And if you're in my past and still talk to me to this day, then yes, you know who I am. But as of right now, you don't. So I guess this is a welcome to you if you happen to stumble upon this. First, to start things off, we are going to take a blinker because it's very, very fitting for this video and what I'm gonna be doing today. And that is a get ready with me, but faded as fuck today. I'm hitting my pound cake plug and play that my boyfriend got me for Valentine's Day. Thank you, lovies. Plug blinkers? They're different, there's something different. Stizzy blinkers are easy as fuck, like, let's be real. If you're tripping over a stizzy blinker, we got issues. Okay. I've been smoking and hitting my thing all fucking day, so I'm gonna get into this a couple more times and then we'll get started. I can't do blinkers, so like the entire time just cause my throat will murder me. This will be good enough because, like I said, it will hit me and I'll be hitting it like throughout my makeup routine as long as I fucking remember. So, one more time. I typically do my makeup with a brush, but I think I'm gonna do it a little bit differently today. Maybe this one will be cute. I don't want the bow in it. Can I take it out? I can. on the earrings uh. <laughs> fuck <laughs> this is how I should do my um fucking thumbnail Whenever I do that, like if I'm ever taking a video in the car, like trying to like take a cute picture with like the smoking and shit, I'd be hitting it hella like little, like for a little bit of time because it'd be hitting you. Like if y'all know what I'm talking about, like if you be trying to take pictures with your shit or taking videos, like you know what I'm talking about. You just you just do like Okay, let me get started. Let me hear it. Let me hear it. Come on. Get started. Get started. First things first on the realest. Um, that's some real shit for um, this primer because this primer is real shit. Um, it's the only primer that doesn't break me out and makes an actual fucking difference in my makeup, like no fucking lie. I once didn't wear this one day and I did everything the exact same. And I had cried. <laughs> like I'm not gonna lie, like I cry pretty often. I'm I'm a crier. Um I used to not be. We'll get into that later. And honestly the only reason I was crying was because my the new mascara I tried was making my eyes water really bad. Um reboot. Are you fucking boot? Oh yeah, and so I was crying, right? And my makeup started to run. But when the way I usually do it, like it may get like a little splotchy, but it did not look like this. And that's why I was like, I know it's the fucking primer. I just know it. I just fucking know it. I just do. Right now, I've been trying to work on my contour shades because I do not love um, my contour now. And I just got it. I got the Fenty Matchstick in Mocha. And what I used to do is mix some concealer 
and some, um, I don't usually put this on my nose. It's okay, like I said, I'm not doing my makeup my usual way, so we're just gonna roll with all the punches. Whatever this brain decides to do today, we're gonna trust her. We're gonna hope that it all comes together. I used to mix two concealers, one that was a little bit darker and one that was a little bit lighter, and I would kind of like make my own like contour shade, and I think that honestly was what worked best. I'm just too lazy to keep doing that. Um, so I decided to get a matchstick. A matchstick I actually like, but still not perfect for me so i may go back to doing the concealer thing i just need also a good powder bronzer not a good powder bronzer a better color match powder bronzer i just don't ask for help when i go into the store that's the other thing because i want to be able to learn how to like do it myself i would say i'm pretty damn spot on though for like foundations and concealers for exactly like the look that i like to achieve like, I know what concealers I use for what, and it makes me happy. Saying again, it makes me happy. So if you end up looking at my makeup and being like, what the fuck, bruh? Like, <laughs> just know, I don't care. Valid opinion, like, keep it to yourself though, nobody asked. I'm like, god damn. I think I might do my brows a little bit different today. Like, I think I might do them first. I don't do my brows first. And that's one thing you'll learn about me, I don't do my brows first. Um, three things that I love, three things I take care of, and I've been this way since high school. My brows, my eyelashes, and my lips. If you ever see my brows grown out or fucked up, it's because I'm allowing them to. I'm allowing them the space, you know, to continue to grow. Sometimes I like to give my eyebrows, my lashes, and my lips a break so that they keep treating me right when I need them to treat me right. So that's three things to know about me. Eyebrows lashes, lips. I will always take care of them. I do have some shit on my lips. <laughs> it's Fenty Skin. Um, the, I don't know the name of it. It's the lip mask. I don't know what the name of it is. That shit is bomb as fuck. Um, I'm a Fenty whore, if you'll notice like in the video. like I literally use so many Fenty products that it's unreal. Um, manifesting that one day I'll be on her PR list. Putting, sending that dream out there. Bro, even just looking at this, like, even though I have a little bit of concealer on, even though it's not blended, like, perfectly, I still look cute as fuck. I'm looking at myself in the mirror and me and my old girl. Enough said. Uh, okay, I said eyebrows. Let's get on task. I think I'm also gonna conceal them, so maybe concealing them will just make the difference that the pencil would typically make, if that makes sense. Oh my gosh, I'm turning 21 in March. I'm very fucking excited. I just wanna get day drunk, have some mimosas and brunch in the morning, like, you know what I mean? Like, vibe out, go to a dispensary, um, get some good shit. I don't know if I should film it or not. I think I might, just cause I feel like that would be fucking funny. And then, that weekend after, cause my birthday's on a Thursday, that weekend after, I'm getting the, um, sorry, concentration. After my birthday that weekend, I'm gonna be going to Vegas with my friends. Um, I obviously have never done Vegas 21. We're gonna see how it is. Hopefully it turns into a good trip. That one, I don't think I'm gonna record. I love Lil Uzi. Like, literally love him. I seen him at Rolling Loud. It was my senior year, but I can't remember if it was in 2020 or 2019. You get the fucking point, look it up. <laughs> um, it was in the Bay. Um, I seen him and now I'm just fucking sick. Okay. I do want to go to Rolling Loud again, but I will say I don't really want to go in LA. I want to go back to the Bay for it. Oh, fuck. I usually color correct. You know what? Let me color correct my fucking... My fucking... Here. <laughs> yeah, I'm just gonna do this because... 
I don't know. I feel like this is where my acne scars are because I used to have acne. I used to be a little bit uggles. <laughs> so it's okay though. We had a glow up after Accutane saved, saved us. Came in clutch, not gonna lie. I had seen this girl on TikTok say to make your pimples um, into beauty marks. And that's what I'm gonna do with this one because it's flat, like, you know, so I just know it's gonna be like a bitch to cover. So I'm just gonna turn her into a little beauty mark. Not the hoops getting in the way. The hoops. Honestly, my nose contour, that's another thing I've been working on. I've kind of like started to see how I like it. And I feel like it's been looking a little bit cuter. If you disagree, I'm open to constructive criticism. Constructive criticism. You're gonna be a hater. Go hate somewhere else because I will not give you the time of day. I promise you that. I forgot to take off my mascara from yesterday. We gonna have to improvise. It's okay. Okay, I finished getting my lashes somewhat figured out so that I can put mascara on them later. I don't know if it's gonna turn out good. I'll be able to put them on, so. Or put it on, so. <laughs> used to use um, a really dense brush, but then I feel like with this one, I can be a little bit more meticulous and then go in with a dense brush to, you know, like, Blend out the rest. Actually, I'll go in with a sponge because, like I said, I'm trying not to use as many brushes. Y'all probably thinking right now, she over here looking like a clown. I know, but I'm not one. So just know that I got my shit together. I, maybe not together, but I got my shit on a track <laughs> again i feel like y'all gonna judge me but i feel like it comes together okay i've never been one to hate my makeup um and i feel like i've been getting a lot better at getting back into it because i gave up makeup when i got super fucking depressed <laughs> again a story for another time <laughs> i'm gonna take another fucking hit sorry that just reminded me of a lot of traumatic shit I, I'm going to do what I typically do and then maybe I'll go in with a sponge after. You know what I mean? Hopefully I remember. Oh fuck, I didn't finish doing my eyebrows. So, now what I do, since I don't like my bronzer color, I mix some setting powder and my bronzer together. I'm using Private Island, which I don't think is the right color on its own. Okay, but you see how like that's... Oh. <laughs> Maybe it wasn't the best idea to put these on. Maybe I should take them off. We'll look like a boss bitch later. Oh my gosh, I fucking love Get Me On. I don't know if y'all can hear. This is one of my favorite songs. It's called Lie Again. Um, I just, I love it. <laughs> right now I'm gonna go and carve out my brows because I forgot to do that. It's getting kind of interesting because I already put my contour down right there. But I'll go over it. I use foundation on the top of my brow because I don't like the harsh top. Mm. 
I really don't feel like that makes a difference in my brows. This is um, my playlist that has like literally almost every single song that I've ever downloaded on it. <laughs> it's a very wide range of music and I, that's what I love about it. But one thing I will say is I don't fuck with Apple Music Shuffle. Like sometimes it like caters to like what I've been listening to and I feel like a shuffle shouldn't do that. Like if I'm shuffling something that I know has a hell of music and it don't cater to what I've been listening to, like let me skip it if I want to skip it, but like give me a good fucking shuffle, please. Time for another. I'm just realizing I never gave my face a little pat with the beauty blender, so that's what I'm gonna do now. See if this makes a difference. I guess I made a little bit of a difference. My mom literally said I would always get into something creative. <laughs> um, she's my biggest believer. But look, you also hate her sometimes. Mom, if you see this, sometimes you be making me doubt myself. <laughs> me and my mom have a really good relationship, so um, we talk about a lot of shit. My mom always said that I was going to be doing something creative and she thought makeup was my path because <laughs> I would do my makeup so much. Um, I would never wear it out or I'd never wear makeup to school. I would wear mascara and shit, but that was about it. What was I going to say? Reboot. Oh, I don't remember. Oh, when I started doing my makeup, some shit about that. Yeah, and my mom always said I was gonna be doing some shit in makeup because I was doing it all the time and she thought that was really good and I literally would do it and take it off and then take a shower. <laughs> and she'd always be like, why don't you leave it on more for more than 30 minutes? Like, you can't do that. And I'm just like, girl, girl I'm done. <laughs> I, I did it, I took my pictures, like, now let me take it off. like. And honestly, I think the reason, a, a big reason for that was because I never, ever liked my face makeup routine because I couldn't figure it out, not even the foundation, because my skin also was really shitty for a really long time, except for my senior year. Like, that was probably, like, the time that my skin was, like, finally actually starting to, um, like, work with me. That was never, like, an insecurity that came from, like, people making fun of me. Honestly, if they said shit behind my back, I don't give a fuck. Shit that people said about me behind my back, if they said it about me, I don't care. Because obviously you didn't have the nerve to say it to me. But I also don't think that people fucked with me in a bad way. <laughs> well, I was pretty nice. I'm a pretty good person. So if you disagree, then. Okay. <laughs> I just don't care about other people's opinions like that. Um, shout out to my mom for that. <laughs> like, if I made a comment or something about someone else, she'd be like, why did, Why do you care? Like, why does it matter? And not in a way of, like, she was shutting down my feelings, like, she would recognize it, but she would also get me to be like, yo, oh, like, this ain't affected me. <laughs> like, um, but yeah, it was insecurity on my own because I didn't like looking at myself. I didn't like taking pictures. I literally just, I shied away from it. I didn't fuck with it. Um, it was something that was just, they make me comfortable like I I didn't feel good about myself like looking at myself so I avoided it and I didn't want to do that anymore so like, I literally begged my mom to be on Accutane okay I put on my blush a Fenty blush <laughs> after um, I put on my powder just cuz I feel like it just looks better can I do that little, a little cheesy smile look okay. it Anytime I think I say something stupid, I'm hitting this shit. I might be thinking, she's looking like a clown. I'm looking cute as fuck. This is how I do my makeup and I go to work and I get compliments all the fucking time. So I think you're the one who's lying. Um, maybe you're projecting. 
if y'all want to say something because you think that it would look good absolutely please recommend um i like to try new shit <laughs> i'm just saying like you can even leave a shitty ass comment like to be honest like that's fine i'm just saying why why be hateful i'm just telling you to think about your actions <laughs> Think about your decisions. Like, why is that necessary? Why does that make you feel good? Like, let's look deeper inside, please. Because I don't want you suffering. I feel like when I see comments like those, I'm like, those people are holding on to something in their lives. And I hate that they're in that agony, in that utter pain, despair. Since I have a lot of gel in my brows, this little bit of makeup remover will not remove the gel just gonna remove any of the um the concealer wait can you see? i'll just remove any of the concealer that's on top the faces that i'm probably making are really funny and i can't wait to go back how did i get it down there I'm gonna do my lashes, but before I do my lashes, I want to pick out my lip liner. I really like the Revlon um, liners too, I'm not gonna lie. And then, this is like one of those so juicy glosses. I don't know if that's <laughs> what brand it is. It might be Colourpop. I'm gonna go ahead and do my lashes off camera because I'm not ready to give y'all my lash secrets just yet. Okay, I am back with my lashes done. Yes, these are my natural lashes. Um, like I said, they're in the shedding process, but if this is them in the shed, is that a shadow or do I actually have some shit there? A little bit of this. Can you all see that? I've been trying to see how I've been wanting to do my makeup recently because I want to look good on my birthday. I want to outshine everybody, but I don't want to like, outshine everybody like that, you know what I mean? You know what I mean? I'm really just, I just keep taking this look somewhere. Like I said, wherever this one to go. Remember, I could replay it. Replay it. We're just gonna roll with all the punches. Whatever this brain decides to do today, we're gonna trust her. Yeah, see, I told you. Let's take a hit. <laughs> Maybe let's take two fucking hits. Why? Because I'm feeling it. Okay. Just now learning how to do those. I know. I'm trying. I'm attempting. Don't make fun of me. Oh fuck, I wasn't supposed to spray my eyes. <laughs> brush, brush, brush. You know what? We're just gonna. So, I think this is basically it. Let me take this off. I can start looking a little cute again. Just a little cute doll. Not too much, not too much. Oh my gosh, I totally forgot. There. It's there. I don't know if you can see it. I also do have an actual mole on my nose. These ones usually get covered, so. Oh, I can't forget if I told y'all. Good thing I looked down. <laughs> Good. Oh, fuck. Did you see that shit? So. I want to change the background for the outro. Maybe light blue. I just like the light blue, sorry. <laughs> Thank you guys for watching the video. I'm gonna take a couple hits with y'all before I do the complete outro. Let's go ahead and do that. Here we are.
we are at the end of the video. I'm pretty fucking high. I'm not gonna lie. All I have to say is be a good person. Don't be on no weirdo shit. I'm not fucking with it no more, so y'all better not be contributing to that society. Um, y'all are not welcome here if you are, so check yourself. This is the checkpoint to check yourself. I will see y'all when I see y'all. Appreciate you, love ya, and yeah. Peace out, motherfuckers. <laughs>